Today we're going to look at rates of change. We have a problem here with mosquitoes on the island, and it says that the rate of change of the number of mosquitoes is given by this equation here. So this is key. This is the equation for the rate of change. That means this is the derivative already. It's talking about how the mosquitoes are changing. So if we think about what's going on, and I've taken the liberty to graph this already, if I want to show that the number of mosquitoes is increasing at time t equals 6, well, this is my derivative already. I want to know that at r at 6, I want to ask the question, I want to find out if it's positive. If it's positive, then the mosquitoes are increasing. So, go over my calculator. I'm gonna, I have the function in there already. My window is from 0 to 31 because that's my range. And I'm going to just trace the value at 6. So r at 6 is equal to 4.44, which is bigger than 0. Therefore, the mosquitoes are increasing. That's A part. B part then says, at time t equals 6, is the number of mosquitoes increasing at an increasing rate? Or is the number of mosquitoes increasing at a decreasing rate? Well, we know they're increasing, but is it increasing at a, is that rate of increase increasing or decreasing? Well, that means I need to find the derivative of this to see how the rate of change is increasing. So I'm going to find our prime at t. And I can use my calculator to do this. I don't actually need the actual value. Since I have my calculator, I'm going to go over here. I'm going to turn off this. And I'm going to go math down to n derivative of y1 variables, y1, comma, x, comma, x. And let's graph the second derivative. So the derivative of RT is this function here. So I want to find out at 6, at 6, is this increasing or decreasing? Well, if I go trace, oh, trace at 6, I know then that r prime at 6 is equal to negative 1.91. That means that the rate is decreasing at t equals 6. So the rate is decreasing. It's still getting bigger, but the rate of increase is decreasing. So that's a lot of words and very, very wordy. But it just means that the speed that the mosquitoes are growing is actually getting s slower. They're not multiplying as quickly. And there's a bit of rate of change in using the derivative and understanding what's going on. Um, in your packet, you have C and D. Um, omit those because it deals with integration. Uh, you'll be able to do those in a few months.